Hi everyone, I'm Atanas Yonkov and I will show you how to create user introduction tour using the Simple Tour Guide plugin. Once you install and activate Simple Tour Guide, you need to go to the settings of the plugin and configure it accordingly. You can add steps to the tour and by default you have just one step. So now when we visit the home page, we will see that we have this one step and the tour finishes after you click on the finish button. But what if we want to create another step to the tour? And let's link it to the explore button here. So how do we do it? We go to the plugin settings page once again. Click on Add New and let's just add some text. For the sake of the example, now this is enough to create a step. So let's save the changes and once again go to the home page. Now we have two steps and this is nice, but what if we want to link this step to the explore button here? How do we do it? So we need to check the class of this element by right click with the mouse and inspect we will see the element classes. So we just grab the class of the element, copy it, and then once again go to the plugin settings page. And in the step position, we, we just add the class with a dot at the front. Now this is not unnecessary, but it is nice if we want to link the step to a particular element. If we don't do, do this, then the step will just appear in the middle of the screen. So let's see what we did. And now we see how the step is linked to the element. We can add as many steps as we want. There is no restriction here. And we can also customize the tour. On the tour option tab, for example, we can show the tour to locked in users only or show the tour to everyone. We can also show model overlay when the tour is active. And we can choose to display progress bar or just leave it out. So now we should be able to see the tour and the rest of the site will have a dark overlay. So now we basically cannot do anything until we go to the end of the tour or dismiss it. So for example, I can click here and the only way is to dismiss or finish the tour. Now everything is again clickable.
another nice option is that we can show the tour only on one page but remove it on other pages so the way to do this is to use this short code on the page that we want the steps to appear and we need to remove the tick on show the tour on all pages so now we don't have a tour anymore and we don't have it on any of the pages but what if we decide to display the tour on the about page so we need to edit the page and add the short code. So let's add the short code. And we can use the short code Gutenberg block for that. And just add plugin short code. Now we have the steps on the about page. But if we go to the home page, since the home page doesn't have this short code, we will not see the tour. So thank you for watching. Enjoy this lightweight plugin and just send me an email if you have any questions. Good luck. Bye.